Fuck Your Scenes, YouTube, Facebook, uh, ManRescue.com, me and the various sites I work for. It's Tim Span again, started with Mickey Fox, and what the fuck. What up? What up? Yep. Where's all right there. Well, y'all will introduce yourselves, tell us what about y'all. Just turn over there, no more brand. I am Brandon Elkins. I am the only good member in this band. <laughs> I write all the music. And I play guitar, but I record every instrument plus vocals. <laughs> so are you saying you're better than everybody else? Absolutely, I am way better than everybody. We're, we've accepted. It. I used okay. to be in I used to be in Parkway Drive, so. I <laughs> well, well, yes. I'm Royce. I play drums. Um, I get called Barbie a lot because of the hair. I've been wanting to cut my hair, but they say it looks awesome from the show. I don't know. You guys can be the judge. Donate it. Whatever. You can't cut it. Yeah, I'll, I'll donate. Yeah, it. Yeah, it. Donate whatever. it. Yeah, it's up down. Yeah, it's no matter. Um, I also help write with the music. These guys do absolutely nothing. This guy, in fact, is not even a musician. He <laughs> don't believe a word to him. Does not do anything. Uh, that's it. That's all for me. I'm Ricky. I've been yelling for about six years with this guy, and uh, that's all I did. I yell. I'm not a musician. I've come to grips with that. Um, I guess that's about it. I'm gonna uh, do my best to play guitar and. I'm like the token ginger of the band. I'm so you have no stuff. soul? None whatsoever. That's always the truth. You got on it. Well, you shouldn't have a soul. You're a Christian band. You have no soul? What do you pray for? Ginger never had souls. It's not. Watch it's, South Park if it's not. It's important. I suffer from gingivitis. <laughs> it is. So how'd y'all all get to be one of the Well, I started writing all this music and I already had it all recorded. I was like, well, I can't play it all by myself. Nobody will come to a show. They'll think, oh, just one person's playing. The rest is in a computer. No, that's not cool. We're not asking Alexandria. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, no, we came together because we're all good friends, and we don't want this thing to die, and the only way to do it is play music. So. Absolutely. That's oh, about all it is. He and I started a band with a few other dudes Death called Age. The Uprising yeah. in 2000 and. I was a senior in high school. Yeah, I graduated. Yeah, it was in the way. No, we started. We started before. Don't argue. But it doesn't I can't matter. I think it's six <laughs> years. Anyway, uh, we were called the Uprising. We were just kind of babies and everything. Not really even involved in the scenes too much. Just been going to shows for a little while, but not, work, not really involved. And uh, we played what we thought was awesome. And I don't, I don't think it was awesome. I don't have the recordings anymore, but we did them ourselves. And I don't think they're too awesome. Bad. But I don't remember. And well, uh, as we gone. started, right, right. We uh, we had two vocalists at that point. PJ was singing, and I would yell. And uh, in any case, we changed the name once PJ left to Death of an Age. And then I guess as we progressed musically, we got to our current point. We got some new dudes, and we changed the name to Live the Fight. But uh, maybe I'll pick one. Right. We were sitting around. It was, I guess it was me, Brandon, and our old bass player, Daniel. I love you, Daniel. We were all sitting around in my apartment at the time, and uh, we're trying to come up with something thematically that made sense for the lyrics and stuff that we were writing, and we also wanted it to be um, just kind of nothing, nothing too elaborate, just something that's like a statement um, that kind of sums up our music and where the fight happened. Uh, it just kind of summed up what we were trying to do lyrically and thematically with our stuff. So. WTF was an accident. And yeah, yeah it just so yeah, happens yeah. our acronym is WTF, and <laughs> that happened. We were going towards wind turtles float, but that fell through. <laughs> yeah. There was waters that flow, yeah, yeah. but worth the fight stuff, so I guess that's, that's what we're sticking to. It still kind of sums up what we're trying to do as far as thematically and music. So y'all have been touring with Earthworm for a while, and how's that been going? Has the brotherly love. Too so much fun. Too well, much, man. Playing ninja, playing <laughs> around malls. Considering the party. first time we met them, we thought they were egotistical. Honestly, <laughs> honestly, like they, re we really thought that they were the shit. That thought, you know, this whole image. And going on tour, we we're just like, okay, we're just, we're just touring together. You know, we're gonna get each other's name out there. But we got to know each other, and I think 
this has probably been the best one. Five of the so best far. guys. So was the there family. cuddling in the bedrooms? Because we asked there was, some, <laughs> that, there was some with me and Dylan, the drummer, who been best friends for. No one cuddles with me. No one gets a front seat either except for this guy. He gets that front seat. <laughs> there is no, ultimate show. Don't touch the radio or the front seat. <laughs> we, I, the out. most cuddling we did, we stayed in the Dandelion Inn somewhere, oh, somewhere in Georgia. And that was one nine room. dudes to one room, and so that was kind of cuddly. And with that my, was kind of cuddly. Like, I talk in my sleep, Lucas. Uh, I guess I punch uh, in my sleep. Lucas <laughs> snores. Yeah, I like. I punch in my sleep so bad, I pick my friends in my face. That's intense. <laughs> she mocked me. She goes down. But yeah, those are some, <laughs> probably some of the five coolest dudes we've ever got the pleasure in. Anything. Or just had the pleasure. Or that. Or that. Yeah, yeah. I, I would definitely. Totally upset that this is their sore. last day on this tour. Yeah, 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 they're not getting to finish it out with us, and it sucks. It's but it's okay. Yeah. So uh, y'all recently came on new album, is that right? We did. Yep. In nine January we released it. Well, we were sort of in the middle of December, but the official release was to Yeah, I, I went up to Ohio and recorded it. We didn't even have to go. Yeah. yeah. We just stayed at home. You are lame. We're basically his support group. Yeah, no, we, we were recorded the entire album in six days, which we were told was impossible, but we pulled it off. We pulled all the nighters off. And it sounds good too? Without programmed drums. We like hope every that everyone likes it. We really Real do. drums. Yeah. They're, they're supposed to, the way we constructed it is there's supposed to be a song in there for everybody. Yeah. Whether you like this music or whether you don't. Um, you're supposed to be able to listen to it and you know it, we hope that you know the listener can take something from this. Like we message. wanna we, we don't want to just you know we, we love playing what we play and we play it because we love it. But we also, you know, we want to, you know, invite everyone else to have fun with us too. And we hope that it works. we hope it's you know across. So oh, any attention from labels yet? We've actually gotten uh, Standby Records has talked to us. Um, Rise said they were watching us um, at the moment. They were they're currently watching us just to see how our tours go, how our you know our pickup influence and everything goes. You know, because they, they don't want to take you know a risk on signing a band, but we don't want to take a risk on signing onto a label that's not going to do it. Well, we we've been trying to go you know do it yourself method like we really that's what's to, most important to us right school. now is just. Yeah. Doing it, getting out on tours that we book ourselves. Brandon booked this last one, and it's been incredible. Um, we self-funded and hired the producer. Sorry, for it's shaky. Album. All of it, you know, we just kind of wanted to bring back at least, at least, you know, the, the DIY ethic of a lot of this music how it started out. We wanted to kind of just see what that was, and so far it's been we've been really successful doing it. You know, we've, we've never gone broke on the road. We've never got stranded anywhere. So. Um, it's, I, we're cool with being independent. My choice is yeah. yeah, no, no. <laughs> Las we're, Vegas was fun. Being stranded, yeah, by the way. <laughs> we did get stranded in Vegas on the last four tour. days. Though. That's so on Mission. Wow. Yeah. 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 Um, well, we've been all the way out to Cali. I actually used to live in Cali. Really? Wait, I'm behind the camera. I shouldn't talk. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're not in the interviews. <laughs> yeah, in the shut thing. up. Fuck you. But Fuck yeah, the, uh, our yeah. I'm good at it. <laughs> I did not know what to say. <laughs> Our goal with the new record um, is to give it to everybody for free before we even recorded it. That was our that was our idea. Exactly. Just because if you don't have it, go download it. www.noisetrade.com forward slash worth the fight. Spelled out. Type in your area code and your email address. It'll send the album, the complete album, to your email. Just take it off your email and you have it for free. And if you like it, all that we ask is that you give it to your friends. Just show one person. That'd be sweet. We love show you forever. Person? Can they'll show a person? Can show a person? And then you'll be popular. So we, no, right. that's not going to happen. <laughs> we have the lowest expectations of <laughs> we, we look forward to failure. It's like, if we just fail one time, we got it. Yeah. We're living the dream. Which we try. 